Hi everybody, it's Elena from Artistic Thoughts by Elena. And before you, you see a canvas that I've already kind of prepped a little. I've gotten my uh, paint ready. I should get a paper towel and wipe my hands here real quick. Um, I don't know, I, last night I, was, uh, I said my little prayers and then I went to bed and all I kept thinking was uh, about a black and gold canvas. So I've never used just those two colors exclusively and I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to um, do this though I kind of have an idea a little but uh, I've created a parameter with black house paint my Sherwin-Williams to go and I've poured a combination of black and gold mostly gold I want the gold to come out but um, I'm going to, uh, I don't know what kind of a pour I'm going to do. Huh, should I throw it in straight or should I just do a, I'm not sure what they call that, where you, you put the canvas on top and then you, uh, you tilt it in. You know what, I think I'm going to do that. I should have probably done that to begin with. Well, let's see what I get. So I want to use all this, so oh, I don't. That's just it. I don't want to use all this. I'm just going to pour it. And the, the gold is finally coming out. I used it all. So what do I want to do now? Uh... I think I'll tilt it. See what I get. But I don't want to lose too. I really don't want to lose any of it. It's like real gold. You don't want to lose any gold. So what could I do? Could I do a swipe? Hmm. There it's going a little. I may have a lot of paint on here. Too much. But uh, I like the gold. I'm seeming to get some cell action. See, right here on the edge. Okay, I'm going to put it down for a second contemplate what I want to do there is some gold there there's some ah you know what I think I'm gonna do folks I'm gonna do a swipe a swipe with a paper towel so let me get my paper towel ready a lot of there is some cell action there is, but uh, what do you think I could get from this? I don't know, let me. Let me see what I get. Do I wanna go that way? Or do I wanna go this way? Or do I even want to go at an angle? I think I'm going to go at an angle. I've never gone at an angle before. Let me see what I get. Did I lose my gold? No, I didn't. It's coming up. It's showing up. Okay. It is showing up. You know what? I've been wanting to work with these. 
Let me see what I get. Oh, in a way, I wish I hadn't done that. There's a hint of gold, but the gold is not as prominent as I wanted it. But maybe that's still okay. <laughs> I got these little... Um, what are they? It's a cake decorator thing. And I thought, I wonder if I could use that to swipe. So let me see what I get. I've got this. I've got the round one. And I've got that. And I'm not going to use them on my cake. How about if I get the one with the ridges? Look at all those. See, the, the cells are coming out, though. They are coming out. So I came at an angle this way. How about if I go at an angle this way? Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, I like that because it kind of reminds me of like wind blowing it. How about here, though? It's kind of pretty. Hmm. So, now what do I want to do? Uh, let's try some heat action. Excuse me, folks. Technical difficulties here. There we go. <sighs> this might heat then. I do like the cell action I see right there. And I like the cell action all over. It doesn't have, I did not put any kind of cell activator. Maybe the water did that with the swiping a little. Just a tad. Yeah. I'm thinking. I'm just going to, uh, uh, I'm going to let it dry. That's what I'm going to do. Then I'll print it later. Thanks. So I'm back. And I was just going to let it dry. And then put some blooms on it. But I haven't done chains in a while. So I'm thinking I have some chains here. I'm going to dip them in my gold, just the gold itself, and see what I get. I'm really liking the cell action I'm getting, though, on some parts of it in here. In here, it's not. So maybe I need a chain to, to bring some gold out. But let me try it. Dip this one real good. Make sure it's got plenty of gold on it. Bring it this way. I hope you're in camera range. Are you? Can't tell. 
Yeah, there's the cup. <laughs> it's hard to see, folks. So let's uh, let's see what I get. And I think I'm gonna go from this angle. So let's try it from this angle. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, I don't want to mix the gold up. So let me get another one. I really do need practice with this anyway. That one, it's okay. It's not bad. But let's see what else I can get. That's pretty. Same thing. I don't want to mix them up too much. I have to rinse them. So is this going to be a masterpiece? <laughs> I hope so. You know, I just enjoy doing this so much. I'm going to come up here. Pretty too. And thinking, do I have any more? Those are long ones. There's another short one. Let's see if I can get it. I really don't like the way this looks right here, the first one I did. So I'm going to try to fix it. There, that's a lot better. Yeah, but I need one right here. And let's see what I get. I think I need to use this one. I don't know what I did with my scissors just this moment. But I have a long one. So let me come back, cut this, and then I'll play with it. Okay, that just took a second. I found a real long one. I cut it up. I just get these beads from the dollar store. You know, for all the different holidays they have, like... St. Patrick's Day or whatever, but I am going to dip this one up, and I'm going to start at the top of, on the right there, and see what I get. I think I'll come at this angle so I won't spill it all over it, but let's see what we get. This is really a long one. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to be an acrobat here. Voila. Because I hit other things. Oh, Lenny, you're funny. Oh. Not bad. Not bad. I love the gold. I really do. So yeah, I'm going to let it dry. It will cry out for a bloom somehow or other. But I'm going to wash my little beads now, cover my paints, and let it dry and see what we get. I think I'm liking it. So thanks, everybody. I'll check back with you in a bit.
Hi, everybody. So, oh, uh, that dried really well. Oh, golly. See, what, did you see what I just did? I just dripped. <laughs> I'm using the last of this gold paint. And I want to um, stencil it. There I did it, boo-boos. So, I need to wipe up my boo-boos quick. Oh, there's a boy, a lot has happened to this poor little canvas. Let me see if I can just get a piece of this paper. Oh, good, I did it again. How did I do that? I don't know. This one, too. It's just gone through so much. Anyway, I am going to stencil this before I go any further. Oh, my gosh. I have so much paint for that on there. So, uh, see what I can do. Oh man, this painting just doesn't want to come together. If it comes out good, it'll be a miracle. But this is a skinny stencil. Something's telling me something. I have another brush here. That's no, too wide. This, is this little tiny one. Let me try the little one. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Because I do like the stencil. Let me put this here for for the time being. Hmm. See all the little mishaps that have happened to this? But I'm going to wipe my stencil and I'll come back. Okay, here's another one. Another stencil. And I'll put it this way so you can see it better. But I'm going to get my same leftover paint that I cut up. <laughs> oh. but folks, if you're looking for a professional, I'm not the professional, but I do can. I do can. I can come up with some great ideas now and then. Then stenciling is one of those things that seems to enhance my art that I like doing. You just need a little bit. You don't need a lot. But I'm going to try this. Like I said, this poor little canvas has gone through so much. Here, I I don't know where that green paint came from. There was a smudge when I was trying to dry it. I was a little impatient. So it's kind of gone through stuff. But I'm like, okay, I can fix that. I can fix that. I'll fix that. And that's what I've tried to do. So, I think that should be enough for now. Let's pull it up. Oh, yes. That is pretty. But it needs touch-ups. So, uh, I'm going to let this dry. I'm going to wash my little stencils here. My little roller brush. Then I'll come back and uh, do some touch-ups on it, and uh, but I'm going to let it dry. There's going to be blooms in here somewhere, folks. I'm not sure where. Probably here, maybe there, especially on that big spot there. Uh, maybe there. I don't know. Here. But uh, it's coming along.
long, but needing a lot of love. And I'll give it some love. So I'll talk to you in a bit. So I just uh, stenciled these this i stenciled that that's what i showed you and then i went ahead and did this and this off camera and it may be still kind of wet but um i think i'm going to try to put some blooms on it right now and i'm going to try to um enhance where it went wrong <laughs> oh there were some like i said some mishaps so i've got this red paint that I just mixed earlier today, but it actually has some glitter in it. And I've never worked with this before. Let me show you what I have. It's just, uh, it's called Crafters Glitter. And then I used my acrylic, my red acrylic paint that I have. And where's that? Oh, here it is this and I mixed them together and I think I'm going to keep it kind of simple I'm going to just uh, I'm going to use the red and I'm going to use some black and I have a little tiny bit of gold in here too that I'm going to use so that it's pre-mixed acrylic but I'm going to try to cover up that spot where I messed it up there there and there definitely I'm going to put some blooms so um I'm not sure do I want a bigger bloom there since it's growing up higher I don't know let me let me just see what I got let's mix this baby up some more it's kind of watery do I have some red house paint. I do sort of. It's not quite red. I want to use a little bit of that. I would help if I could open it. Huh? It's like a cherry, cherry red. How would that look? Hmm. I need a spoon. I have a spoon around here somewhere. Huh. And I think I want to put just a little bit of the the red house paint or the cherry red just to give it more of a pillow. So I'm going to use it. And I'm going to mix it up just a tad. And I'm going to pour it right there. I'm not going to need a lot. I'm going to put that right there for now. Then I'm going to get this pretty red glitter, whatever. And I'm going to put it right there in the middle. We're all over it. Okay. And I don't have another spoon for that, but I can pour it gently. Just a hint of this gold. Too much, not too much, not too much. And then I need my black cell activator. Okay, folks, let me blow this baby out. And I'll show you what I get. 